moment. Most of the child advocates working with our Forever Family partners are adoptive and foster parents themselves. Tonight, our friend Eric Thomas is introducing us to one of them. You've been a foster parent. Yes. You've adopted. Yes. What do people need to be aware of? It's not easy, but it is so rewarding to see those kids grow and expand their worlds. It's a feeling of no other. When a child comes into your home, it's your responsibility to show them love, show them care, show them what things can be. And when they go home, they can take that with them and use that for the rest of their lives. You want them to go home. We want them to go home. When that's not possible, we do look for an adoptive family because every child deserves permanency. You ended up adopting, did you not? I did. Seven Homes gave us that call and we never expected to take in a teenager. We were thinking 10 and under, but we said yes. And it's been the most amazing experience. We were a young couple. We were 25, 26 years old and taking in a 13 year old. So not much age difference there, but it made it fun. We, we could do things with him that we couldn't necessarily do if he was a little one. It was just fun because we were still young enough to do all those fun activities and run around with him. My son is now 18, so we're in a whole nother world of learning how to grow up and take care of ourselves, what bills look like. <laughs> so it's very different, but I, I would never take it back. I would never do it differently. And, and here in North Carolina, you adopt a teenager, you have all these benefits. You know, the state pays for health, the state pays for college. Those teenagers need you. They need you to step up and show them what love looks like. Eric, thank you. To learn more about adopting or helping children in foster care, contact Forever Family in partnership with Seven Homes Family Foster Care by visiting foreverfamily.org. Coming up next here on On